Police are going door to door looking for answers as another Chicago family mourns the death of a child. The 12 year old boy was one of seven people killed in the city over the weekend. Lexi Suter talked to his devastated neighbors and is learning more about the effort to find his killer. I'm just sad. News of 12 year old Damian Green's death is making its way around Inglewood. When I heard about it on the TV yesterday, you know, I mean, my heart was so heavy, I couldn't almost hold back to tears. Police are spending Monday going door to door, searching for answers and for a suspect. They need to just stop all of this shooting. The kids, you know, they want to grow up in their community. You know, they want to go to school and feel safe. I want to feel safe. I'm a senior citizen. Police found the young boy on the ground with a gunshot wound to the head around 630 Sunday night. Green died at Comer Children's Hospital. Now there's a $15,000 reward for information leading to an arrest as the aldermen and police call for information to help with this investigation. As a city, as a neighborhood, and as communities, we can come together and provide the information necessary to hold those individuals accountable. We need to stop thinking and praying. Thoughts and prayers are not good enough. Right now, what we need are more people involved. We know the 12 year old attended Benjamin Mays Academy and is one of seven people murdered in Chicago over the weekend. 23 people in total were shot from Friday to Sunday. They need to stop it. Just stop killing these kids. Stop killing people. So far, no one is in custody, but police are asking anyone with information to call the CPD homicide tip line. Reporting at 35th in Michigan, Lexi Suter, NBC5 News. Right, thanks to Lexi.